That's right, this next section is actually sort of broken up by cutscenes and kind of has a really, in my opinion, has a really nice flow to it. Um, we'll head back to the security room as our main goal here, but uh, I enjoy how this section unfolds. It gives a nice, nice feeling that things are happening even without Frank. Or around Frank, or whatever. Frank can go around slashing zombies all he wants, but the world moves without him, and that's a, that's a great lesson for all mankind. Or something. You know what? Fuck it. Let's stop thinking deep and go back to killing zombies. Oh yeah. I'm in a trash can. Once again, some wonderful coffee creamer. Love this spawn location. It's pretty much always there, so... Do remember to top off if you need it. Oh wow, talk about saved by the bell. Or phone. Frank. It's over. HQ's decided to ignore us. What? What do you mean, ignore us? I contacted headquarters, but... The government has decided to deny all knowledge of what happened here. Special forces will arrive for cleanup at midnight. They'll take everyone out. Zombies, people, everyone. Well, poor little Jesse's not doing very well good. And our zombie attacker is now gone, so there's an extra bonus. Anyway, we're going to continue making our trek back to the security room. Hopefully we can get back there before midnight, which is apparently pretty soon here. You know what? I'm going to eat a snack. Mm. There, I have defeated the gray health bar. Once again, we trek here through the park. Uh, not a lot of difference, again, just a lot of zombies. Just uh, since you don't have to escort anybody, go ahead and make your way as quickly as possible. I guess you can mess around, not really a big deal. Because we're not really under time constraints right now. The story will just naturally unfold around us. Oh, screw you, zombies. I'm going through that door. No one stops the West Man. Once again, I'm sort of health itemless, so we'll do a quick stop up. Stop up. Stock up. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I think I'll do something a little different. Um, hmm. If there's anything over here. Actually, I haven't been. Oh, it's a ladies' store. Uh, only thing in lady stores tends to be like purses. Occasionally you can get a dress. Purses are terrible weapons and dresses look awful on yeah. Frank, so sweet. By the way, you'll see that we since we now have maximum strength or close to it, we can actually beat the shit out of people with these gems. I don't know if you remember when I did this earlier in the LP, but it pretty much did nothing. Here it almost instigates like four or five yeah. zombies at once. It's pretty awesome. Go away. I've got work to do. Alright, almost to the security room. Go reassure Jesse. Everything's gonna be alright, lady. No need to cry in a corner.
Ooh, free queen. That picture looks terrible. Jessica McCartney? Talk about your close calls. You contacted us just in time. Your boss thought we should have a talk with you before the operation begins. We'll be taking you into custody. If you sign an agreement to keep your mouth shut about all this, you'll be free to go. Oh, holy fuck. Well, that was sort of out of place. So in case you're curious, yes, Jessica McCartney is now a zombie. She actually takes place of Nemesis in this game. And will run around going stars as an homage to previous Resident Evil games. It's really weird. None of that's true. Yeah. Jesse. Quick little cutscene there, but still pretty poignant. I love the gunfire in the background. It kind of sets the tone. And uh, let's see what's going on in here. Now oh, that's interesting. Where the hell is she? God, she left her glasses. How will she see? Wonder if that was her. Anyways, there she's not in this room, so there's really only one place I guess she could be. By the way, not nice of her to leave her food all over the floor like that. And here she is. Zombie Jesse. Just like Zombie Brad, there is an achievement for taking a picture of her. You'll see we get the... Ooh, erotica? Really? Anyway, Snuff Shot J achievement. And we'll just put her out of her misery. Sorry, Jesse. Sad to see you... What the hell? Oh, great. Did all that work for nothing. All those speed runs, all that music. And they take them away. Yes, that's right. Every single one of our survivors is now gone, taken by the military, off to parts unknown. Hope they're still alive. Anyways, here's something I never talked about. PP stickers. Take a picture of them. There's an achievement to get all 100, but all right. I'm not going to do it. Once you take a picture of it, it crosses it out. There's actually an X across it, which you can't see, but we're done. Alright guys, I will see you next time. And we'll have a little bit more craziness towards the end of Dead Rising. We're getting really close. See you guys later.